It fell about the Martinmas time, and a gay time was it then, when our good wife got puddings to make, and she's boiled them in the pan. The wind sake it blew south and north, and blew into the floor. Quoth our good man to our good wife, Gae out and barred the door. My hand is in my husky fap, good man, as ye may see, and it should nay be barred this hundred year, it's no be barred for me. They made a paction tween them twa, they made it firm and sure, that the first word where should speak should rise and bar the door. Then by there came two gentlemen at twelve o'clock at night, and they could neither see house nor hall nor coal nor candlelight. Now whether this is a rich man's house or whether tis a poor, but near a word what I know them speak for barring of the door. And first they ate the white puddings and then they ate the black, though Muckle thought the good wife to herself, yet ne'er a word she spack. Then said the one unto the other, Here, man, tack me my knife. Do ye tack off the old man's beard, and I'll kiss thee, good wife. But there's no water in the house. And what shall we do then? What ails thee at the pudding brew that boils into the pan? Oh, up and started our good man, an angry man was he. Will ye kiss my wife before my een, and scat me wee pudding brie? Then up and started our good wife, gave three skips on the floor. Good man, you've spoken the foremost word. Get up and bar the door.